I was in Tuckawala State Prison, and I hated when it would rain, bro. Like, I would hate it because right where my motherfucking bunk was, bro, it was like a hole in the wall, G. Like, but you couldn't see the hole, you know what I'm saying? You could just see the drip coming down, bro. It was like... And the cops always want to come over there with a towel, G. You know what I'm saying? They're like, hey, bro, uh, can you get a little, like, a little bucket to put right there? Hell no. Nah, y'all going to use this as a weapon. I'm turning it into knives or something. I'm like, bro, hell no. Nah, it's a trash can. I'm going to take care of that shit with my life. Let somebody come over here, G. You know what I'm saying? I come and come and high his ass. You know what I'm saying? They're like, fuck that, bro. Nah, you get an extra towel, put on the floor, and then every couple motherfucking hours just go and smash it in the toilet, G. You know what I'm saying? You get a brand new bucket. It'll be like, G. And I was like... Nigga, cold peace, bro. Whatever, G. You know what I'm saying? So we'll eventually go in there and steal a bucket, G. And every time it fills up, we'll dump it in before the hoodas walk around. You know what I'm saying? We'll hide it, G. Fuck it. Thug life, G. Straight up. So anyways, <clears throat> I hate it when it would rain, bro. And I thought about it because it's hella raining out here in Cali right now. And um, there was one day when me and my boy Snow from the San Fernando Valley, bro. He was like, hey, bro, should we go outside? And I was like, I don't know, bro. You heard the motherfucking hoodas, bro. They said, like, nobody go outside, bro, because it's like fucking a thunderstorm and shit, bro, and he was like, I got this motherfucking Camel Crush original, I was like, ooh, come on, fool, let's go, I got a motherfucking wick right now, so we went over there to my motherfucking cube, and I put two pieces of lead inside of the uh, the thing, you know what I'm saying, and popped the motherfucking socket, fool, and I took the wick outside, G, so we out there smoking a the frajo, bro, and it starts, like, hailing, bro, it even starts hailing by the light, you know what I'm saying, like, we, we could survive, pero... But it was still hitting us, so we were walking like this. <clears throat> I was like, damn, bro. We start walking, bro. You're always trained to smoke like this. When you bust it, the frajo right here, the J right here, whatever. So you smoke like this. You know what I'm saying? So when you're smoking, all the hoodahs in the towers, all, all, all they see is this. They can just hold it so long that the smoke disappears. You know what I'm saying? Because you appreciate the smoke. And then you're like... I swallowed it, G. You think it's a cook about? Be like, yeah, if you just swallow it and blow it out, but you've held it for like 17 minutes, G. Hell no. Nah. So, you know what I'm saying? You just, you don't know, bro. So, when we out there, we were able to smoke for a little bit like that. It's covering the water, you know what I'm saying? But before we knew it, it started pouring, bro. So, we start walking. It's raining so hard and it's so windy that we don't hear the hoodahs like, get your motherfucking ass back in the dorm right now, G. You know what I'm saying? We don't hear none of that, bro. We're just like, Running around, bro. You know, well, actually, we're walking, bro. Terrified. Keep it G. I was terrified, bro, because I was almost getting lifted off the ground. Even though I was in prison, I was on super squeezy mode. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? I was still getting, like, lifted off the ground, bro. Like, palabra. You know what I'm saying? I was like, oh, hey, bro, I think we should maybe head back, G. He was like, come on, bro. This is pretty fun, bro. I was like, all right. Like, he was laughing and shit. You know what I'm saying? I was too a little bit because... <clears throat> let me let me tell you that. I was laughing because I was trying to hide the fear. You know, like when you laugh, you're like, ha, ah, but inside you like fucking terrified on some monsters ink. When the kids see them and shit, you know what I'm saying? When Mike Wazowski pop out of there, you know what I'm saying? You're like, what the fuck? That's how I was inside, bro, because I don't know what the fuck, bro. It was like thunder hitting like a basketball court away, G. It was like, what the fuck, bro? We in the middle of the mountains, you know what I'm saying? So when we start getting back towards like the there's like a sergeant office on the corner. You start hearing like, what the fuck are you doing? Like very lightly, bro, I heard it. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, hey, perro, you hear that on me? And he was like, yeah, fool, we stopped, bro. We're like drenched, bro, walking. He's like, we look, there's a little flashlight. Get your motherfucking ass inside. Like we put a little flashlight and then you hear like some little, me, 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 you know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh, bro, we need to go inside. So when we start walking toward the door and we start seeing a little flashlight over there, I was like, fuck, man. We get over there. They're like, the CEOs are right there. And we come in. They're like, what the fuck were you guys doing out there? Were you trying to escape? Man, I was looked at the motherfucker. I said, hell no, bro. I don't even like cold, G. The homie looked at me. I looked at him. He was like, all oh, the hoodas was looking at me. It was three of them right there. They was like, Get your fucking ass in the cube right now. I was like, fuck, G. We walked over there, G. And then sure enough, bro, you know what I'm saying? The homies came up to me. They was like, hey, bro, you know what I'm saying? You caused a little bit of ruckus because of that, G. The who does is tripping, bro. So, you know, we're going to have to whoop your ass. I was like, I know, bro. I'll go ahead and report to the, to the designated area, bro, when time comes. He was like, 
for sure. You know what I'm saying? But it was fucking a trip, bro. Like, that shit was fucking terrifying, bro. I was like, get back to the motherfucking dorm. I was like, hey, bro, like, you wasn't scared? He was like, no, nah, fool, that shit was fun. I was like, but you're like this much shorter than me, bro. And you probably weigh less, bro. Like, you wasn't getting lifted off the ground? He was like, yeah, that shit felt crazy. You know, I was like, at that moment, I fucking understood. Like, different people have different, like, fears and adrenalines and shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody's different, bro. Like, me, I'm the type that, you know what I'm saying? I'd be by, like, on heights and shit. And I'd be like, ooh, I can't do it, G. Go on and wheel me down, G. I can't look anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, if I was high enough, bro, like, I would really trip out, bro. And, um, but if I see, like, a spider or something, you know what I'm saying? I'll whack that motherfucker down. You know what I'm saying? Limb for limb, G. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't do that, but you know what I'm saying? I'll whack it, bro. And then there's other people, you know what I'm saying? Like, my lady terrified of spiders. You know what I'm saying? But they'll walk, like, on some hikes. Like, she was, you know, she'll be over there by the tallest motherfucking mountain. Like, damn, that should look a nice-ass picture. Let's take a nice picture right there g but you see a spider pop up on her ass she'd be like ah oh godzilla you know what i'm saying like an asian bro like in the like in the movies g no offense no disrespect bro i love all my races you know what i'm saying but just saying oh fuck she get crazy g but anyways man this is a motherfucking video i'm dropping for y'all today bro i love y'all bro thank you for your support thank you for your comments thank you for your reposts thank you for everything man like on everything i appreciate you and make sure you fucking stay woke to everything going on, man. Black and brown, we out here.